since I was a kid, I've, I've always dreamed of being an inventor. My first car I bought when I was 14 and uh, proceeded to tear it down the next day and really focus on how I could make it into something that was more sustainable. Not only was I gonna have to pay for my own gas when I got my driver's license, uh, but I was gonna also have to deal with the impact that I was making by driving that car. And I began the process of converting it to run on vegetable oil. The movement of goods has been shown to lift communities, whether through reaching new markets, increasing productivity, or increasing the availability of services within a community. How do we bring that opportunity to a community without the associated impacts to the environment and the atmosphere inside of that community? I first realized this when I was working in my family's fleet. Here we were contributing to the community, helping build infrastructure, roads, airports, but we were having a significant impact on our local air quality. I couldn't reconcile this fact. And so I began the search, began looking for alternatives. We talked to fleets, we talked to mechanics, we talked to service technicians, we talked to drivers. We really wanted to understand the problem that we had here. And what we realized is that zero emissions trucks could be a reality. Electric trucks not only worked, but they worked better, they were quieter, and they performed on the job for drivers better than any other diesel alternative. From working with UPS and Loomis, where we got the buy-in from some of the largest fleets in the world that really want to do something about their emissions, we realized that we were not only building a more sustainable future for the communities that we lived in, but we were also helping them with a business challenge that they dealt with every single day. All of our trucks, they operate in neighborhoods, they operate in communities, they operate in cities where ourselves, our employees, our family members all live. And we really centered on how we can improve the communities that we live in and how the impacts of our vehicles can have a long lasting impact there beyond the term of the demonstration. That fifth element is people, right? Is why are we focusing on these solutions? It's, it's to really improve our quality of life for the people around us, for the people in our companies, um, and for our neighbors. Now when I see a truck driving down the road, I don't think about the impacts that it's having on the local air quality. I think about the opportunity that it's creating, and I think about how we can continue to improve our local air quality by continuing to electrify the last mile.